Dear veterans, thank you. Thank you for your service and sacrifices. Without you, our country would be broken. Without you, our country would not be free. Dear veterans, thank you. Thank you for fighting dreadful wars to save our beautiful and magnificent country. No words can explain how warm-hearted and courageous you are. Again, thank you. You protected me. You enabled me to have freedom. You risked yourself so that I could be safe. You persevered for those you love and cherish. And those you don't know, you fight for everything. Thank you. Not all heroes wear capes, some wear boots, fly planes, drive a boat, but they all mean the same. They are old and young, past and present, fight for freedom, often taken for granted. Not all heroes wear capes, but the uniform of the U.S. military. Without you, the world would be different. People's freedom would be at risk. So thank you for protecting our country for risking your life for others, for making the world a better place. Bravery is a word no one can say unless they know what it feels to be away. Away from family, daughters and sons, wives and husbands, where bravery is needed most. Thank you. Thank you for serving America. Thank you for keeping us free. Thank you for saving lives. Thank you for stepping up when others can't. Thank you for everything you do. Hello, I'm Michael Holmes, Colonel, United States Air Force, retired. And behind me is a portrait of my father, Chief Master Sergeant Cecil H. Holmes, also retired Air Force. I'm proud of his achievements, and I'm proud of your achievements for all the sacrifices that you've made to this great nation. I salute you. So on behalf of Six Mount Zion Baptist Temple and this country, we all salute you and say thank you. Thank you.